Here in Iowa, there is a focus on stopping drug cartels. We've learned that federal agents have arrested 29 people over the last year with links to two cartels. Chief investigative reporter James Stratton is here with a connection between these cartels and Iowans. James and Eric, the DEA says people with connections to the Sinaloa and Jalisco cartels are selling drugs right here in central Iowa. DEA arrested 29 people with those connections in the last year through what it calls Operation Last Mile. All of those cases are sealed, but DEA says it's top priority, these two cartels. DEA says these two are responsible for the quote vast majority of fentanyl and methamphetamine sold here and across the country. In DEA's five state region, special agent in charge Justin King says the agency seized 932 pounds of fentanyl alone, all with ties to these two cartels. They want to push these products out there and push it in. So if you just take that and look at that as a community, if you have addicted people, you know, of course, death is is the worst thing that can happen. But if somebody is addicted to drugs, that affects the whole family. And King also says those with connections to those cartels are also reaching out, selling drugs on social media. Last year, 237 people were killed by opioids in our state. According to the state, 89 percent of those were fentanyl deaths. Across the country, more than 3,300 people were arrested in just the last year in that Operation Last Mile. Eric.